Hello friend, welcome back to Toyota Maintenance YouTube channel. I'm performing a bunch of maintenance service on 1997 Forerunner which has that 5EZ FE V6 engine. And in different video you can see how I performed throttle body cleaning. And the experts or people familiar with this year and model of engine, they will immediately say, well, did you clean the IAC? You see that valve on the bottom? That's an idle air control valve. So let's do that in this video. And to able to clean this valve, I have to remove it from the throttle body. Now, it's held with this four Phillips bolts and I remember in past some of them were so tight that I had to use the impact Phillips so let's see how tight are these awesome this is amazing because that gave up easily maybe I'm so strong right now nothing can resist me I'm just kidding it was probably just old and in bad shape okay so you saw all four of them gave up okay so the bolts are off and let's see how dirty this valve will be when we remove it broke it off fortunately the gasket is good this is cleaned and there are remainings of that cleaner from throttle body cleaning but I can see and I will show you the detail this is definitely dirty and needs to be cleaned and let's zoom at that valve so you can really see those details of that carbon buildup that black stuff which could be plugging those valves and then what happens you have a problems with the idle so it's right there there is like an element which is ran by that electromagnetic motor and it's turning it this way and basically it's opening or closing the air and to clean that I will use this spray brush catching pen I have protective glass and most importantly I have protective glasses so let's start and see how much mess we will end up with in that catching pan after we are done with this service and you can already see that terrible junk which is flowing in that pan and it will keep coming well it's fantastic we can see that this service was definitely needed I'm not trying upsell the customer he's my friend when we saw the throttle body and we didn't know how much service was done on his newly acquired forerunner uh, we decided most of us that really this needs to be done and it can save him headache in the future as I mentioned before, when you have a problems with this valve, uh, that means your idle on your vehicle, it's all over and that, that's how you know that that might be uh, related to this IAC valve, which we are cleaning right now. So let's do the close up again on the valve and see how much that black residue we removed out of this valve. I see huge improvement. Now if I can compare it, this was like one of the cleaner ones. I saw these valves really gunked up and clogged and it was a miracle they were even uh, working. But most of the time they weren't. It was just too much and some of them were so in such a bad shape that it was better to replace the part. Unfortunately, I'm afraid this valve costs like 200 bucks. So yeah, this is basically it. I will let it dry for 5-10 minutes. 
shake it out everything and I'm going to reinstall it back on throttle body and everything is going back. I didn't plan on this service so unfortunately I don't have that a rubber gasket that will be advisable advisable to replace right now but as I said I didn't plan on this so I will just reuse it and it should be all good so my friend make sure you are subscribed because I have ton of Toyota tech videos coming your way thank you for sticking around and I'm wishing you wonderful wonderful day